Hey guys, what's up? This is the Electricians in Action, where we get together and we talk about the code every morning before we go out and fight the good fight. You can catch the EIA every day at 9 a.m. Let's get to it. All right, guys, today we're going to look at the question, does the NEC require all detached garages to have electric power? Now, your local code may, but the NEC does not. And we're in Article 210 today as we jump into this. So Article 210, everywhere that it talks about what you must do in an attached garage, which is going to be required to have electricity, it, it, you know, and it dictates how many outlets you must have, what you must do for lighting and all these different things. Every time it talks about a code for the attached garage, which is required if it's there, it says or detached garages that have power so the NEC does not dictate that you have to have power on that detached garage but it says if you do you got to follow XYZ you got to follow these rules and you're going to treat it pretty much just like a uh, attached garage so the NEC does not require you to do it your local building code may do it your local inspector may require you to do it on some type of new construction application but as far as the NEC goes guys it's not required to do it I hope you guys have a great day let's get to it Hey guys, I just want to remind you that I offer free coaching for anyone who needs help in life or business. If you just want to email me at electricalcodecoach at gmail.com, let's get to it.